Okay guys, today we've got an 06 truck that came in stock and we're going to tune it and put a 6767 Taterbilt turbo on it. So we thought it'd be fun to do a dyno with it completely stock, no tuning. And then we're going to flash a tune in on an all stock truck, uh, see what it makes. Then we're gonna put it in the bay, put a turbo on it, put it back on the dyno and just get a back to back comparison for you guys. There you can see the difference between a stock tune, this is stock horsepower, this is stock torque, and with just the change of an EFI tune, we're making more horsepower than what we did torque on stock. We made 1,013 foot-pounds of torque at 2,100 RPM, we're making 460 horsepower, made peak power at 28, 2,800 RPM.
give you guys a little recap of what we accomplished today. We started the day off at 274 horsepower. This is a stock 2006 Dodge 59 uh, from lift pump to airbox, everything stock untouched. And we installed EFI Live and a Taterbilt 6767 Turbo on an otherwise stock 06. We started the day at 274 horsepower to the tire and we ended the day at 570 horsepower. This is the same turbo that we've done over 900 horsepower with, with 250% overs and a 12 mil pump and a pretty decent engine setup. But even on a stock truck, it drives nice and gives you the potential to add horsepower or get, add fuel down the road and pick up significant gains. Like and subscribe to the Firepunk channel if you enjoyed this video. Uh, leave a message in the comments if you have other comparisons you'd like us to do. We've got a good team of guys here. We'd be glad to do some different comparisons. If it's something that interests you and helps you guys out, we're here to do it.